In an interview on Wednesday, Bolton admitted that he had helped plan coup d'etats in other places. Pedro Infante, president of the Special Commission of the National Assembly to investigate United States aggressions, said on Saturday that the commission had launched an investigation into the new clues blurted out by Bolton. These statements constitute new inputs and evidence for the investigations in Venezuela. We're facing the transnational crimes against the republic. Some governments and leaders should confess their crimes against Venezuela to their own people and others. Bolton's statement has also sparked outrage among the general public. What he said, I think, is a lack of respect for our sovereignty and for all the Venezuelan people. We, as Venezuelans, must fix our own problems internally, be they political, economic or social. Venezuelan President Nicolás Maduro won his re-election in May 2018 and took office in January of 2019. The opposition accused his camp of rigging the election and refused to recognize the election's results. Opposition leader Juan Guaido declared himself interim president on January 23, 2019, with the support of the United States and other countries. Maduro condemned the opposition's coup attempts and severed diplomatic relations with Washington.